Okay, so here we are again. Um, I'm all moved into my new place in New Orleans. I, I have to say I, I like it a lot better here in the city than I did uh, in the, uh, the suburban North Shore area of Louisiana. I, I, I lived there for a year and I don't think any of my neighbors ever so much as talked to me. But the first night that I was down here in the new place, um, uh, one of my neighbors in invited me in for uh, red beans and rice and uh, smoked three blunts with me, so it was a good old time. Um, you see that that I did right there, straight up? That's a little charming anecdote about what happened to me recently. And it's, it's the kind of thing that you would never do, you know, since you don't reveal uh, details about yourself. Anyway, um, I watched your uh, video, your response to mine, and y you said a lot of bullshit, but the, the only thing that really mattered to me was the words, I accept. That's, that's what I was listening for. That's what perked my ears up. So good, good. I'm, I'm glad that you accepted. Um, I suppose we need to set a date now, don't we? And then pick out furniture. Right, said a date. Sounds like we're getting married. Uh, how's next weekend for you? And if that doesn't work, uh, the weekend after that. You can uh, contact me by making another video, or you can uh, you can send me a message here on uh, YouTube. You can have your people call my people, or uh, or have your have your people troll my people. Right, that would be a little bit more apt. Um. Yeah, sorry I took so long to, to get back to you. I've, I've been really busy. Um, but since uh, since YouTube has allotted me 15 minutes, I guess I'll respond to some of the things that you said in your video, which I watched a little over a week ago, uh, so it's really going to test my memory. Let's see, what did you say in that video? You said that... I am I am a liar because I said that I had no way to respond to uh, Fake Sagan Fails Volume 2. And you pointed out that this uh, this account I'm using now, the Smooth Terrorist, I'm sorry, the Smooth Terrorist, that's how you said it correctly, by the way, um, that that was registered two months uh, previous to Fake Sagan Fails uh, Volume 2. And you're quite correct, anybody can uh, look at my channel page and, and verify that. But what you failed to mention or didn't know is that uh, when YouTube banned me, they didn't just ban the fake Sagan account, they banned my computer's IP. And creating a new account was the first thing I tried to do. Um, but being the resourceful gentleman that I am, I went to a public computer at my local library and I registered this account right here, the Smooth Terrorist. Um, now, of course, to actually make videos on YouTube, I would have had to record them at home and then uh, edit them and burn them onto a flash drive and bring the flash drive to the library or the internet cafe or what have you and upload them to YouTube there and, eh, you know, pain in the ass. Uh, this is my hobby, not like my calling in life, you know, I'm, I'm not going to go to that much fucking effort, frankly. Um, not to mention the fact that YouTube, having so recently banned me, would have recognized my face the minute I poked my head up out of the sand and, and just banned me again the way they did with Brett Keane and uh, Kisburn 2000 and, and, and everyone else that, that I've seen get banned. You know, you try to come back the minute they know it's you, you're gone. If you're wondering uh, what's preventing them from doing that to me now, uh, nothing. You know, it's it's been two years, I don't think... The YouTube staff, frankly, have that much memory, but if, if they do, uh, they could ban me tomorrow. And if, if that happens, we're still going to have this debate, because, uh, you know, I said that I would do it, so it's on. It's on like Donkey Kong. Uh, how much time do I have here? Oh, good, ten minutes. Okay, so what else did you say in that video? You said that... Um, you know, I'm not going to convince you to reveal any personal details about yourself. Uh, I, I don't expect to, Dopey. That, that's kind of the point. You know, I know you're a coward. I know you're a punk. 
I know you're scared to let anybody know anything about yourself, even details that, uh, you know, frankly, would put you at no risk at all, like, like your age, for example. I mean, nobody knows how old you are. How would that affect your personal life, this personal life of yours that you like to keep separate from your internet life? Is that just an excuse to cover the fact that you have no personal life, really? It's just a crazy theory of mine. Um, you, you know, what, what difference would that make? I was born in uh, 1979, by the way, July 4th, uh, as, uh, as, as, it, as it happens. Um, you know, this anonymity thing, it, it, it doesn't really have to do with uh, whether or not you show your face. That, that's kind of a straw man argument that your, uh, your fans have been uh, leaving in, in comments uh, regarding this, this debate. Um, you, you, you know, there are people who show their faces in videos that I still consider to be anonymous. Like, look at a guy like How the World Works, uh, Lee Doran. He shows his face in every video, and yet do we really know anything about him? You know, if he stubbed his toe or locked his keys in his car that day, would he tell us about it? Uh, if he, uh, you know, asked the girl out that day, would we know about it? No, you, you know, because... And, 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 that, that's what uh, anonymity really is. And, and, and there are people uh, who I'm anonymous, you know, com comparatively to. Like, uh, Mills Basket Case, she, she goes into so much personal detail. You know, if she gets into an argument with her mother or something that she's going to talk about it in the video. So compared to her, I, get, I guess I'm anonymous. But the point is, uh, varying degrees of anonymity, they're, they're sort of like weight classes in, in boxing, you know. and. Um, I, I'm a guy that likes a challenge. I, I, I like to, uh, you know, try to pwn somebody, own somebody, uh, however you want to pronounce it, who's kind of in my own weight class, whereas you, on the other hand, fight dirty. Uh, you know, you target people who reveal a great deal about themselves when you don't reveal uh, anything at all about yourself. Um, but I'll, I'll save this for the debate. Uh, you, you said that uh, you were worried I would move the goalpost or change the topic of the debate. I, I don't really see how I could. The topic of the debate, I thought this was pretty clear, is uh, your anonymity and whether or not it makes you a coward. Uh, you know, in view of your choice of uh, targets, I, I guess you would say. Um, you know, obviously I'll be taking the pro and I, I expect that you would take the con. Um, yeah, there will be no moving of the goalposts. Don't, don't, don't worry about that. What else did you say? You said, you said that I am uh, obsessed with you. Hmm. Well, you know, Dopey, you've made two videos about me. And I've only made one about you, the, the video in which I challenged you to a debate. Uh, you've left countless comments about me throughout the years on various YouTube videos. Uh, I don't remember ever making any comments about you. Maybe I did. Um, you know, I've, I've only recently started showing interest in you, at least publicly, at least in any verifiable way. And uh, most of the instances that, that you showed in, in your video of, of me talking about this debate on Blog TV came about because people in the uh, chat blog TV chat section asked me questions like, hey, what's up with the straight dope debate? And then I respond and start talking about it and, uh, you know, obsessed with you. I, I, I think I, I think it's kind of lame that you're taking that tack. I, I think that's, that's a pretty weak argument. Um, you know, it, I, I suppose if there were any pictures of you, I could print them out and plaster them all over the walls of some secret room in my basement and you take a red sharpie and write kill over and over again. Uh, if, if you want to believe that, if you, if you want to believe that I'm obsessed with you, that I'm on some uh, Captain Ahab-like quest of revenge and you're my white whale, if, if that's what you want to tell people, uh, okay, sure, I'm, I'm obsessed with you. It's, it's, it's not going to save you from the, the, the uh, the thorough trouncing that you're going to get at my mighty hands when we have this debate. Um, and, you know, if, if, if saying that I'm obsessed with you, like, if, if, if that's your A game that you're bringing right now, I, I don't think you stand a chance. 
in hell uh, of winning this debate. So, I still have about four minutes left, but why belabor the point? I, th I think I've said everything I need to say in this video right here. Um, so I'm thinking next weekend, uh, the weekend after that, you let me know what you want to do. As, as for format, I'm thinking maybe we could do it on Skype, and I could broadcast the Skype conversation on Blog TV, on the uh, Fake Sagan account on Blog TV. Now, of course, you won't have to show your uh, beautiful face, that you can remain in the shadows. I plan on showing my face just to underscore what a pussy you are and what a pussy I'm not. And we'll, uh, we'll, we'll get this done. We'll, we'll have this debate. Although, you know, uh, frankly, you know, you, you pointed out in your video that this is a, that you think this is a publicity stunt. Uh, duh! I, I said that in the challenge video. This is a publicity stunt. I've already gotten over a thousand subscriptions since challenging you to the debate, so in every way that really matters to me, I've already won. Um... But, you know, it's, we're still going to do this. It's, it, it's all uh, dopey. Because I think, um, you know, I, th I think you've had this come up and coming for a long time. I think you've, you've been uh, operating unchallenged, with impunity, doing what you do, for far too long. And it's, it's time somebody called you out. And it's time somebody took you to task. And, and we both know I'm the one to do it. So, uh, can't wait to see you there, pussy. This has been The Smooth Terrorist, and if you enjoyed this video and you don't want to see it disappear, then download it, re-upload it, parody it, make it your own, because the folks at Google can't censor me unless you let them. Thanks, everybody.